Bonjour, je m'appelle Anthony. Et maintenant, nous allons regarder Everglo. Zombie. Not to be confused with the cranberries. We got some different, some different type of berries on the screen right now. 107.69, your host with the most AR. Not the boast, but let's raise the toast. Damn. I'm subscribed to Everglow because I wasn't. Shame on me. I will like the video. Support the original. The link to the original is in the description. This was a request by Levesque, who was with us in the chat. Thank you. I'm going to be posting a lot more on the K-pop channel. So, support the original. Very creepy. to this remember what we talked about before with older genres being reintroduced the resurgence of older genres and they bring them back through newer with newer elements and stuff so i'm hearing some type of old school r&b in this with a dark undertone like this eerie vibe just from the laugh in the beginning of course the video is creepy as hell y'all y'all ever seen the the movie it's something about chucky it's this a chucky movie and it's an insane asylum and there's like seven chucky's running around this reminds me of that, because they all look the same with the blonde hair, they all got the same. By the way, smart thing, making the backup dancers have black hair. That really emphasizes the group with blonde hair. Ah, I see I see what they're doing. Y'all you know what I'm talking about? The Night of Chucky or the Curse of Chucky, something like that? Really reminds me of that, because it was also in a... This is more of a hospital thing, but... Uh, so yeah, the resurgence of R&B type of style mixed with trap elements. Because you can hear on the percussion and stuff like that, it's more modern touch to it with the production. Get me? <laughs> Thanks to you, thanks to you, let me try, but I'm just living now. I like this. Thanks to you, thanks the to cult you, of Chucky, thank you. It almost looks like horns. There. Yeah, so people don't expect this from me. Because I always listen to like, you know, rock and, and rap and shit. But I actually really like this, sty this style. So I'm, put I'm putting it to my vibes playlist alongside the song we just heard by Cannons. Alongside uh, Cheng Ha's song. She has, a, she has a song, a very good bopping song as well. I'm gonna put this on that playlist and just yeah probably just vibe to this in the car i, I really like this type of i don't know i really like the like females like smooth female vocals on top of some some dope beats Flatline. 
For a second, I thought we were getting a new metal breakdown. I'm a zombie! Da, 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 da. I thought we were getting that for a second. So it's the whole premise, it's the whole concept of this song. It's just like the calling and stuff. Like, is it about people being so attached to their mobile phones that when they are present with other people, they're not really present because they're so isolated in their own world because of like social media and shit? Like, is this the whole meaning of the song? Lavasque, do you know? Very nice visuals too. That that uh, part in the middle with the breakdown, the crack phone, beautiful shit too. Yeah, I like it, man. I like this. 